Welcome back to our channel, where we bring you the latest insights into the world of clinical research. In today's video, we will explore the fascinating topic of how sponsors select sites for clinical trials. If you're curious about the intricate process behind choosing the right location for these important studies, then you've come to the right place. So, let's dive in. Before we delve into the selection process, let's discuss some of the key factors that influence sponsors when choosing clinical trial sites. Key factors influencing site selection. The first factor is patient population. Sponsors are looking for sites with a pool of eligible patients who meet the study's specific criteria. The site's ability to recruit and retain a suitable number of participants is critical for the success of a clinical trial. The second factor is expertise and experience. Sponsors prefer sites with experienced investigators and research staff who have a proven track record in conducting clinical trials. A site's expertise in the therapeutic area being studied is particularly valuable. The third factor is infrastructure and resources. Sponsors consider the site's facilities, such as the availability of laboratory services, equipment, and access to imaging or diagnostic facilities. Adequate infrastructure ensures the smooth conduct of the trial and accurate data collection. The fourth factor is regulatory considerations. Sponsors evaluate the site's adherence to regulatory guidelines and its history of successful regulatory inspections. Compliance with ethical standards and good clinical practices is of utmost importance. The fifth factor is geographical location. Sponsors may prefer sites located in regions with a higher prevalence of the target patient population. Additionally, factors like local healthcare infrastructure, transportation, and accessibility play a role in site selection. The Site Selection Process Now that we understand the key factors, let's explore the site selection process itself. The first step is for sponsors to develop a site selection plan, outlining their specific requirements and criteria. This plan acts as a guide throughout the selection process. The second step involves identifying potential sites. Sponsors may use various resources like clinical trial databases, medical literature, recommendations from key opinion leaders, and collaborations with research networks. The third step is conducting an initial evaluation of the potential sites. Sponsors review the site's capabilities, experience, patient population, and infrastructure against their predefined criteria. The fourth step is the pre-selection visit. Sponsors visit the shortlisted sites to further assess their facilities, meet the investigators and research staff, and ensure alignment with the trial's objectives. The fifth step is the final site selection. Sponsors consider all the gathered information, evaluate the potential risks and benefits, and make a decision on the sites to be included in the trial. Conclusion Selecting the right sites for clinical trials is crucial for the successful execution of research studies. By considering factors such as patient population, expertise, infrastructure, regulations, and geography, sponsors can make informed decisions that lead to reliable and valuable data. We hope you found this video informative and insightful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel for more engaging content. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next video. Remember, together, we're making a difference in the world of clinical research.